We're getting right into another mission here after the first Flawless. Um, I don't like that there's a Sectopod on it, but there's not too much I can do about that. We're just going to have to take him out. Setting course for Sector 2, and Australia. And I'm honestly not quite sure uh, what we're dealing with here as far as uh, soldiers. Because I know someone's bond training right now, so I don't think I can use them. And... We got people away on a mission, too, so that's not great. Uh, I can send myself in. I'm fully healed now, right? See that? Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 56 of 56. Okay. So I'll send myself in with old guy. Two specialists, because that's how we roll. Um, uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Is she good to rock? Yes, she's good to rock. Perfect, perfect. Okay. Uh, we send Mox in, I think. I want to send him in. So we'll send him in with his bond mate. Giggles. No, I don't want to send that many specialists in, though. Actually, maybe I do. That's a lot of chances to um, mess with the mechanical units. And that's a lot of damage, now that I'm thinking about it. So we'll leave him in there. I can't send General in. He's tired. Oh, he's a sleepy boy. Um, well maybe we send a lower level Grenadier in? No, we've got a Grenadier. No, we don't need to worry about that then. Um, just a Sharpshooter without the Bond Mate? Or maybe a Ranger. Yeah, maybe a ranger. We'll send Sputnik in. Okay. And we gotta quickly equip everybody here. So, he's gonna give me the bolt caster. Um, EMP grenade. Where's the... No, I don't want to give me Skulljack because I'm a healer. That is right. I'm a healer. So, give me the, give me the med kit. Ah, uh, okay. Sorry, just checking a message there. I was waiting for someone to message me back. Give me one second here. Ah, uh, Hanweirs just let me know she got home. Okay, that's important. That's an important thing to know. So we'll blue screen it up because I need to be able to do the damage to the enemies. That's pretty important. Uh, and the EMP bomb is good, so he's good. Um, old guy, what skills do you have? You're also a medic. Wait, what am I then? Why am I also a medic? We can hack. Okay, this is kind of silly. Why do I have two of these guys as medics? Wait, no, he's not a medic. He's a hacker. I'm just looking at it wrong. I'm an idiot. I'm a big idiot. I'm a big idiot. I know it. Uh, you take pepper. You take, you know what? Leave your grenade alone. We'll give you the Skulljack, and you're going to be hacking, so we'll give you, hmm, So many messages. Okay. Uh, I think we'll give him... No, you know what? Not armor-piercing rounds, because he's going to be concentrating on mechanical enemies still as well. Uh, Mox needs armor-piercing rounds. Because his weapon is low damage already. 
We'll give him the stinger. I think that's what we want, right? Clip size with plus one damage, plus two. Yeah, we'll give him stinger. Uh, fusion ripjack is fine. We want him to have a mimic beacon for sure. And uh, I think that's good, actually. Where's the grenadier? Ag cannon. We learned this last time. These do more damage. We will give her AP rounds as well. And also a mimic beacon. She'll be launching grenades and shredding things for the most part. Oh my god, what does he do? Giggles, what do you do? You're also a hacker. Which is good. So your loadout. I mean. Prototype plasma rifle, I guess. Mimic beacon. We'll give you blue screen as well. So the specialists are the ones with the blue screens. I won't get confused this time. Um, you've got armor piercing. You've got armor piercing. Sputnik, you should take. So you know what? You take the tracer rounds. Sputnik can take the AP rounds. Sputnik can also take a proper gun. Boomstick. We'll give you spider suit. And instead of the plasma grenade... You know what? I kind of want to give you the frost bomb. Just in case he gets into trouble. We'll give him a frost bomb. Okay, I think everybody looks good here. Um... You got weapon upgrades. Ooh. We'll leave that. I just want to check uh, weapons here really quickly. Can't do... Oh, wait. Do you not have a PCS? Wow, I got a lot of them. Okay. Um, maybe I won't worry about this right now, because that's a lot of clicking to get through. Not bad. How you doing? How you doing? What, why do I not, uh... I should know your username, since you're giving me my name, but, uh... <laughs> Who? <laughs> oh, okay, okay. <laughs> I was just like, wait, what? How does this person know my name? I'm good. I'm good. I'm having a I'm having a good time so far. I'm just setting up to do a mission that I'm hoping we can get a flawless on. I'm just checking some of the weapon upgrades here. Oh, we do have an extra slot now. Okay. So where's the We only have one advanced scope. Boo. Uh let's do. Now we'll leave a free reload. Let's do. A superior stock. I'm gonna... So, miss shots with Stinger. Wait, is this Stinger? This weapon doesn't have a name. Why doesn't it have a name? Pepper. It does have a name. Okay. I'm gonna fix Pepper. I'm gonna add, add, add to Pepper. Uh, weapon upgrade. Pepper is now gonna do damage no matter what. So, if I miss a shot, I'll still do three damage, which is good. We're going to do that. Yes. Confirm that. Pepper's looking upgraded as fuck. Uh, mag cannon. I want to also check the mag cannon and make it beefier if I can. Ooh, and I can. Okay, what are we going to put on here? Uh, repeater? No. Superior autoloader. Ooh. Autoloader might be nice on this, actually. Just an advanced auto loader, though. Two free reloads is good, or maybe an advanced scope.
No, auto loader. Okay. Looking beefy. Do we want to do anything to Boomstick? We can't. Boomstick is already fully upgraded. Let's change the look of Boomstick, actually. I'm not liking the craziness. Let's change to... Uh, where is the hex? We'll switch to hex, and we'll switch Boomstick to, uh... uh mm. There's like a bright red. Yeah, we'll do that. There we go. Boomstick's looking nice and red now. Good times. All right, let's start this mission and hope no one dies. It'd be really nice if they didn't. I'm gonna mute the mic for a second while I chew on this frisket. Sky Ranger deployed. We're in the pipe, five by five. You're in for a hell of a show. This message is going to be crazy. Yeah, it's a, it's a Blue Yeti. I've got it on the, um... I don't want to move the camera because of the green screen, but I've got it on the shock mount, the compass shock mount. Uh, it's just front firing right now, so it's only capturing from the front here. So, I have some audio filters that I use, though. So I got a few things set up in OBS that uh, make it sound a little bit more robust. Oh shit, I forgot to equip, uh... I forgot to equip my other spider suit. Okay, we gotta go there. And then we gotta go there. That's the exit. Okay. We all move in stealth. Everybody's concealed, though. Oh, this is good. Okay. Um. Let's grapple, grapple. Oop. I take a new approach. We'll grapple up. Oh man, we almost got revealed. That would have been bad. Balls, balls. Um, we gotta go there. There's probably enemies maybe on this. Actually, no, this is the edge of the map. Are we in the bottom corner? Ah, we are. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Let's be cheeky and move over to here first. See what we can see. Nothing yet. Well, that doesn't make me nervous at all. Where are the enemies? Hmm. Let's also get you up. Heck is hot. Um, and we run. Where's cover? I want to stay. Well, I guess there's no enemies on that side though, that I can see. Let's, um, Copy that. run you up. Oh, I left the bad sword on you. Oh, I'm sorry, Sputnik. You got the crap sword. Oh, well. Uh, okay. Who we got next? Mox. Got old guy. Okay, this is where it starts to get a little bit dicey, because I got to start looking around and seeing who's where. That's a scanning protocol. Ooh. Uh, yeah. I don't normally use this, but let's use a scanning protocol. What can we see? Go. Anything? Wow, that was a waste. It told me about these two civilians over here. Oh, wait. No, no, no. No, there they are. There's some. I see you sons of bitches in there. Okay. 
I want to know where the big scary robot is. I know that there's nine units on this map that I have to fight. They're probably over here. So we have got, judging by the hit points, this is the... Oh, is that an Andromedon shell? That might be an Andromedon, actually. And, uh, that's a shield bearer. Okay. Well, I mean, I guess we just start moving up. Uh, we're still cloaked, so we should be okay for the time being. Stepping off. So, uh, let's see what we can see. Hmm. That seems like... Oh, it goes over a little ways. That seems like a bit of a dangerous move, but... I need to start... Well, uh, maybe just, we'll just move over to the car. On the move. That's me. I gotta keep myself safe. Okay. Let's, um... Let's just overwatch. Overwatching. I will not waver. And Giggles needs to go somewhere... Uh, well, I mean, we don't see anything over that way. I think Giggles might be safe going up here. I hope Giggles is okay going there. Okay, is anybody patrolling? Is anybody moving? I don't see anything. Did these guys move? Yeah, these guys moved, okay. That's good to know. Um, shit, I I don't like this. Can I get? Where can I get to that's safe? Probably nowhere. What am I saying? Um, well, I mean, going down here is not going to hurt too much. Good to go. Ooh, yeah, I saw you in there. There's three of them in there. It's I not just... Visual. Yes, okay. What are they, though? You don't have visual. You don't have shit. I can't see them anymore. Fucking guy. Fine. Overwatch. Come get some. Mox, um... Got that, Moxie. Go down there. Oh, boy. Dangerous stuff here. Go on, Overwatch. So I guess that means... Remote hacking... Spotter, stand by me. All right, they're bond mates. Okay, yeah, we'll run up. Roger that. I might actually put them all the way forward here. I just want to scan this building. Okay, it looks like we're good to run in. Up to here, maybe. Well, we got two guys over watching on the roof, so. Okay, we're good. Uh, Giggles, you can get right up as well. Copy that. Warhorse. Um. Shit. I gotta be careful. There is a big angry robot here somewhere. I know there is, and I don't know where exactly it is. And he's going to be a problem if I trigger him. Um, you know what? We'll just go up here. Okay. And I'm going to get my narrow ass up there, too. Rolling out. Got it covered. Okay. Are we okay? Have they seen us? Are they patrolling into us? What's happening? Apparently nothing. Well, okay then. Oh shit, that's a door! Ugh. I can't even open it quietly. Is 
Is it control? Yeah. Yeah, you know what? Just go there. I kind of want to use another scanning protocol to see what everything is. We'll waste it. Whatever. We'll just waste it. It's fine. Ooh. What do we have over here? Okay, so it is actually just a foot soldier. A couple advent troopers. We've got our target over here. Where the fuck is the sectopod? How can a giant chicken legs robot just hide? He's huge. Okay, well... Um, we're gonna have to do something here. Get Warhorse forward. Can we get someone up here without, like, getting spotted? Because that would be fantastic. Let's try and do that. Location confirmed. See what we can see. Oh my god. Can I really just run people up here without any problem? On it. I'm gonna pay for this. I'm sure I'm gonna pay for this. Is that... Yeah, that's actually a safe run, too. Dashing. Man, these people are going to be so tired after this mission with all this running that I'm making them do. I hadn't even considered that. It's going to be a bit of a problem. A great distance. Go, Mox, go! That's a run and a half. So far, we're... Completely fine. I can't believe this actually. Eyes on the prize. Are they patrolling in there or are they just standing there? Oh, I hear him now. There he is. Holy shit, there he is. He's not hiding anymore. Ugh. Definitely not hiding anymore. Okay, who can hack? That's what we want to do here. Haywire, what's your... Ooh, you are garbage at hacking. No, not you. Oh my god. Ned, are you the hacker and you're all the way back there? Shit. Location confirmed. What I'm doing right now with the bench bunching up all of my soldiers on a roof is a really, really bad idea. But no one's seen me yet, so... Just see what happens here. Okay, they're going along there. Oh, we can't see it anymore. Shit. Okay, what are we going to do here? Resistance broadcast. If we hack, that'll be bad, though. Oh, wait. I have to unlock the door. I don't want to do that yet. Um, we just plasma grenade. Oh, where are they down there? Shit, I can't see them anymore. Oh, jeez. Okay. Where's the... We need another scanning protocol. I know we have another one, so... We'll do that. We'll get the scan going. Because I need to be able to see them before I launch grenades at them. Okay, that's good. That's all well and good. Oh, they did move out. Shit. 
Oh no, they're all bunched up in the corner. Oh. That's not gonna work. But if I go in there, no, I can't see if I'm actually hitting them. That should hit them. By all rights, that should hit them. I'm really concerned though. If it doesn't hit them, that's bad. That's a bad look. But let's open it up. And we'll see what happens. People are gonna die. Like my people are gonna die, I think. That sectopod's so close. Oh, whatever. Fuck it! <laughs> oh boy. Ooh, 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 baby. Okay. Oh shit, they did actually activate. Okay. How many whip? What? How many enemies are over there? You're fucking kidding me. Oh, I'm so screwed. I'm so screwed right now. How has he only got a 37% chance against that thing? He just fires at it. Oh, man. If I throw a plasma grenade, can I hit all three of the guys that are in there? I didn't even... Oh, I did hit... Okay. Okay, we need to... Oh my god, we're so fucked. I didn't know there was another crew behind that thing. That is so bad. Tired of waiting around. Please hit. Okay, that... That's the thing that happened. Giggles, you need to get in with something. You know what? We have to get some of these mimic beacons down. I don't have a choice. Um, wait, who's your teammate? Mox is your teammate. Doesn't really help. Okay, I can... Shoot that son of a bitch and maybe kill him. Probably not, though. You've got a frost bomb, so you don't really help us that much because it barely hits anybody. Okay. We do have to get a Mimic Beacon down. Well, that was the worst move I could have possibly made, I think. Toss a Mimic Beacon out there. Oh, boy. We're really not in good shape here. 12 to 13. And that bypasses armor. That's the frost bomb. And I mean, we can attack, but it's not really going to do too much. Wait, am I still concealed somehow? I don't get it. What is that activating? 
Overwatch. Shit. Does this count as an action? Does not cost an action. Okay, does not cost an action, so we'll whiplash. That's worth it. No, it didn't. We will throw the second Mimic Beacon over here. Oh, this is... If we actually manage to somehow survive any of this, I'll be impressed. I need to... Oh my god, I can... Well, that's clearly what I'm doing, because then I can grenade them from above. A useful aid. Oh, they're gonna move! For fuck's You're sake, I thought they already dead. activated. We... We fucking hit them with a grenade! What are they doing? Yeah, we'll just justice this guy, I guess. At least we can kill someone. Justice comes for all. Yeah, pull, pull him up. Give him the claw. Watch Oh no! Oh, thank God he didn't blow up. They oh. No more. Oh, that was almost a really bad move. Wow. Okay. Okay. He's dead. So the sectopod is gone. The big, the big guy's gone. He could have actually caused problems. VIP is secure and we're on the move. Menace one five status confirmed. VIP is in tow. Proceed to the extraction point. Um, that's actually a fuck. How did they not activate? Oh my god, this is an absolute fucking clusterfuck. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Um, Bob Russell, you're. I'm sorry, dude, but you're gonna get destroyed. I can't even move him. He's gonna die if he moves. Well, if we try and move him and he doesn't get killed, that's a good thing. But he's gonna get killed. Oh my god, it got... Okay. Huh. Alright. Oh, that's one small problem somewhat dealt with. So we got one, two, three, four... Five, six, seven people that are going to take shots if I don't do something here. So, I mean, uh, who can I, I can't attack anybody from where I am. If I move, if I move here, I can potentially kill that guy with three health. That's one less shot that can be taken. Solid copy. Oh boy.
47. Oh, fuck off. Oh, that's so dumb. How is it 47 to kill that? <sighs> Run and gun it is. Well, we're not going to be able to kill that guy, so I guess we try and frost bomb the... Shit. Can I hit anybody with the frost bomb from here? Nope, not the one I want. Well... I guess we go back over here, even though I don't want him Not there. Either. And we frost bomb this asshole. Okay, they're gonna burn, which is, you know, whatever. Okay, he's gonna burn. So we got two mimic beacons. There's too many guys taking shots. They're all going to do damage. Unless this guy comes up to try and kill Mox. Nope. So, seven enemies, seven shots. They're gonna each die in two hits. One's down. Maybe we'll get lucky here. What's he doing? Mimic Beacon? Thank God. Oh! Okay, we're gonna get three shots hopefully on the one Mimic Beacon. The fact that they look like they're running even though they're not supposed to look like that is kind of tickling me a little. Please don't kill him. Oh, thank God. Maybe that stupid robot will, oh no. Oh no. He had a 100% chance to hit and he missed. The robot's gonna go after him then. This might actually work out somehow oh my god getting a little too warm over here oh there's what the fuck race one five we're picking up an enemy transport inbound on your current position of course they need reinforcements Okay, what can you do for me? We can get these two and potentially blow up. Oh, that's a good one there. Okay. That's the that's the shot right there. She's got the only mimic beacon left. Whatever, we're we're fucked here. Like I have to start killing enemies. Come on. Okay. That was a good thing. Uh, I guess, like, I... Gotcha. Then we can run him back, at least, I suppose. Like, not that it's really going to help that much. <laughs> um, this poor bastard needs to be further back.
Can I? Oh, I don't want to do that. Mox, you can attack multiple people. Who can you hit? Okay. Let's get you to Wrath to the um, Shield Bearer. Hopefully that'll actually work. Um, the end please, please, coming. Mox, don't fail me. Oh, you failed me. Failed. You fucking asshole, Mox. Ugh, fine. And kill him, please. For the free. Oh, boy. Okay, um... Who can we skull mine? I'm not skull mining that guy. That's dumb. Okay, well. If I go here. Finally. We can combat protocol. That officer will die. I think he's still on fire. So if we combat protocol him, he'll die next turn. Or we can teamwork. No, let's combat protocol. I really hope that he takes one damage on his turn. Or we're in for a really rough time. He looks like he's still on fire, so I think we're safe with that. Uh, Giggles needs to... Who can you... Oh, you can teamwork Mox. That doesn't really help that much, honestly. But tossing this grenade might. No, we don't need to attack him. We get him up here in the corner. I'm trusting you here. We can combat protocol. That'll kill the specter. Oh, I want to kill the heavy mech. Wait, haywire. No, we want to combat protocol then. Or can we just attack? Yeah, we can just attack and kill him. We don't need to use combat protocol. Pyro, thank you, buddy. I appreciate it, yeah? The big 3-5 today. Should, uh... Hopefully not lose too many soldiers while I'm celebrating. We'll see. So he's dead now. Uh, do we have combat protocol here? We do. Let's get rid of the second specter. That's a really good idea, actually. Oh god, I'm in so much trouble here. I didn't kill the purifier, which is not good. But none of my guys can get taken over, so that's, you know, a start. Let's just hunker down. So the purifier's there. This guy over here should burn to death. He's gonna take one damage. The purifier is gonna hurt somebody. And I guess this guy's gonna defrost this turn. And where were they dropping in? Where were those assholes? Right there. Wow. Okay. Okay. All right. I think. Done. Yeesh, well, we will see. Ah, thank you. Thank you, Josh. Oh, who's going to drop in? What is it? Oh, a purifier and what? Oh, God. A heavy mech. Great. Did they drop right into fire? Please tell me one of them is going to catch on fire. Yeah, he died. Thank God for that. 
Okay, he's thawed, but that means does he act? I don't know. These guys get a reaction move. Okay. Oh shit, he's gonna do blazing pinions, isn't he? Please do blazing pinions. Ah, good! That's not even a problem, thank you. Everybody just moves out of the way. It's perfect. Oh shit, but he's gonna do something really annoying, isn't he? <gasps> no, not him, please, 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 please. Ah! Ah! Right. About to get burned to a crisp! Okay, we need to get off this building. <laughs> there's, there's issues with the uh, structural integrity of this building. Who are we on? Um, is blazing? Oh shit! Somebody's overwatching. Okay. Well, who can I? Where's Mox? Can you throw the grenade all the way over? No, he just barely can't. Oh, that's a disappointment. Oh well, he can hit the he can hit the purifier somehow. I saw it. Yeah, he can hit the purifier, but not the uh Oh, it's so close. Okay. Well, that's not going to work. Um I need to not get hit with blazing pinions a bunch. That would be good. And that Archon is going to use blazing pinions next turn and come down, so do I really need to worry about him currently? Probably not. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to run Mox over to the edge. Oh, God. Okay, where is he not going to get overwatched? Really? There? Boo. Because I don't want that guy to overwatch, and I want to be able to one-shot him with my other guy. So let's go here. Now I should be able to grenade him. Yes. Okay. I mean, might as well blow up some cover while I'm doing it. Please, Mox. Okay. Overwatch is removed. Now I should be able to... Can I hit him from here? Yes, I can. Okay. What's over there? We'll get the... We'll get the air on... Him. 13 to 15. I mean, there's a low chance, but we should kill him. There's a low chance we won't. Oh, good, we did. Okay, thank it's Christ dead. for he that. Oh, boy. Alright, Warhorse needs to... Oh, my God, there's a purifier over there, too. Shit. Uh, Warhorse, you come over here. Here I come. Out of the blazing pinion range. Let's get a mimic beacon down somewhere because God, we need it. We'll draw some of the enemy fire next turn. I cannot reload, which is not optimal. But what I can do is come down over here. Tired of waiting around. Out of blazing pinions. Use my second combat protocol to kill that guy. How the how the fuck did I pull this off? How did I do this? Um it's not quite the default UI. I've got something called um, extended information. So, like, 
it's kind of the default, but it's improved a little bit. So, I highly recommend some of the UI mods, in all honesty, Pyro. Uh, the game gives you a decent amount of information, but not enough. So this, like, see how I have a hit percentage here, and it's like, but probably 88? It actually kind of looks at all of the shots the character has taken, and what the percentage is, and everything. I love... Uh, I would recommend starting with War of the Chosen. Definitely. Don't waste your time with the original XCOM 2. It is brutally unbalanced. Really, really badly unbalanced without the expansion. Okay, so that guy is gonna come and touch us no matter what, I think. So we gotta... Uh, what are we gonna do here? We need to get out of Blazing Pinion range. Roger that. We'll go here. And we will take a shot at him. Hopefully we don't miss. Oh, amazing. Okay, that's good. Um, you might as well come hide beside... You know what? No, you, we're going to start getting him moved up. You're not gonna you're not gonna miss out on the story. War of the Chosen adds to the initial story, so it actually it's the same game, it just adds more to it, which is good. Um, there's these aliens in XCOM 2 and in War of the Chosen called Alien Rulers. And um, in XCOM 2, they're so broken that literally if you if you move, they get a shot. If you hunker down, they get a shot. If you take a shot, they get a shot for every single one of your characters. And then they take their own turn. Now, it's toned down a little bit in War of the Chosen, but it's still an absolute fucking ball ache. I've been avoiding them like the plague. I do not want to deal with them. So, that's kind of where that's at. But otherwise, story-wise, War of the Chosen is the way to go. It's just the it's just the better setup, better everything. Um, I want to. Well, not want. I need to is more like it. I need to take a shot at that Archon, but I don't know where I can do it from. And it's just him left, so I think we're going to move. Oh, it's hard to see sometimes, too. I think we're going to move over here and take a shot at the Archon. Here I come. I think we can hit him. 81%. Probably 84. Apparently, uh, old guy here has been better at hitting his shots than most people. 19% chance for a graze, though, which I don't like. Hit him. Come on. Yes! Okay. So far, we haven't taken a single point of damage. Mercifully. I don't know if that's true anymore. Did anybody take damage? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Someone... Some, oh, no, he's going after the... Yes! He's going after the beacon. He's going to dink him with his staff. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh shit, okay. We're gonna take damage, finally. Please, just miss. Somehow miss, point blank. Did he miss point blank? Too close to the heat! <laughs> How? How the fuck is this happening? That guy hasn't hit a fucking thing the entire game. Okay, where's the scientist? I need to get his ass a going over this way. Um, let's be careful though. I don't want to get him too far away from my my mans. That I'm so glad I put that beacon up though. The mimic beacon saved our bacon just now. Like really? Are you kidding? It's a one shot kill. I'll take that. Hell yeah, I'll take that. How is he doing this? Oh, that's a long run. Wow, Mox. 
Yeah. All right, he dead. No and he still gets a go because he's fucking box. That's why. You think I can kill him? Yeah, let's try. Oh my god, executed. Executed means the, the like, 5% chance for him to instant kill an enemy procced, and he instant killed an enemy because he's a fucking legend. Okay, um, oh wow. This is... Reloaded. Just in case, I'm gonna start running someone up to protect the, uh, the payload. No, I don't want to move, move out of cover. Already there. We gotta protect the payload. Okay, Giggles, I need you to jump down. If you say so. Collect whatever this was. Oh, advanced hair trigger. Yes, yes, please. The hair trigger is the thing that does the instant kills. So we'll kill him. Oh, no, he's a dick! Okay, he didn't blow up. I'm so lucky. I got it, right? Oh, I wasn't, fast. I wasn't even thinking. That guy can blow up when you shoot him. Okay. We... I can't, I can't even right now. Like, this has been the luckiest run of my life so far. I can't even comprehend how we have not taken damage. Getting it done. Let's get me up there. I'm gonna get myself evac next turn. Okay, Hound Dog. Or Sputnik. I don't know why he got the nickname Hound Dog. Feet, feet. What? Wow. Alright then. Who's way back still that needs to get caught up? I go quickly. Go, Mox, go. Giggles, I need you up there too. Affirmative. Okay, where's the scientist? Go to the evac and get the hell out of here. I can't believe that we pulled this off. Like, I just flat out, I cannot believe it. The BIC is under my protection. Oh, my God. Good to go. Warhorse needs to get down here. Go, go, go. All right, I'm getting, well, you know what? I think everybody can make the run next turn. Let's just get everybody in a position to actually evac. Dashing. Here I come. Yeah, you know what? No, we're not gonna evac. Well, you know what? I can call the Sky Ranger somewhere else the entire time I could do that? Oh, I could have moved the evac zone closer. Okay. I, I. Live and learn. Watch them uh, bring in some reinforcements now. <laughs> Laugh. Okay, you can get there, which means Mox can definitely get there. On it. Mox. Moving quickly. Uh, you... Warhorse, get over there. Solid copy. I need to get in there. Let's do this. Is everybody on? Everybody ready to go? Evac all. Let's go. Ending deployment. <laughs> We're fucking out, boys. We're out. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Holy shit. Bonus. So this is one of the mods I have installed. If you flawless a mission, normally you don't get shit in the game if you flawless a mission. So I installed a little thing. So every flawless mission, you get a little bonus item. What It's randomized and you get bonus ability points. So flawless. Oh my God. Let's come on. Back row needs to be visible. Mox, you're in the way, dude. Okay, no more mob formation. Let's go with the wedge. 
All right. Is that... You know what? We got a squatting slab in the back there, which is great. Let's do that. Advent Wrecking Crew. I'll take it. Holy crap. Holy crap. I cannot wait to watch the... Uh, the video of this now that I now that I'm done I'm I can't I can't believe it oh I didn't even realize I was cutting my head off there a little bit oh what if we tilt there we go that'll be better in the shadows plotting to destroy oh man have built to return us to the chaos of the old world only together can we oppose them United in the elders' love for us, we shall prevail. Sure thing, dude. Sure thing. I love the I love the random propaganda in the game. It's actually pretty entertaining. Oh. Uh, man, we have had a good night. I don't know if I want to do like Booski. You just missed all the warriors. action. Only one person boss. is tired after all that? And it's the Grenadier. Wow. Yeah, Booski, you just missed an insane mission. I have no idea how I flawless that mission. It's actually worth it to watch the VOD when I'm done tonight, because that was insane. I thought, I, I honestly thought I was completely fucked there. Oh my god, and we got perfect cohesion between these two now, eh? Huh. There's a bond available. Yeah, let's do it. Sputnik and Nada. Yeah, we gotta get a bond photo. Oh, look at that, too. Fire and ice. Ah, uh, that's perfect. We'll Tell take them that. To pose near an Advent burger menu. For science, of course. Oh, Tegan, calm down. You'll get your burger one day. Or Tigan, if you want. I say Tegan. Warhorse is tired, though. Oh, man. Okay. I was honestly just considering calling it a night because, uh... We've had two flawless missions so far, and I know, I just know that when I go into the next mission, it's all going to go to pot. It's just not going to be good. Ah, uh, what do I do? What do I do? Let's go look at the map. Considering the limited resources available to you, Commander, you have still managed to exceed my expectations. Let's Excellent just see work. what was I doing? Setting course for the South African sector. We'll finish we'll finish building this relay because I started like a few minutes late. And then I'll decide. Signals coming through clear. PCS effects are increased. Okay. 